Hey everybody, I have a new book for you today. This one is a pocket size book. Um, it's called Moments of Mindfulness, Anti-Stress Coloring and Activities for Busy People. It's by Emma Ferens, and she's the author of the Mindless Coloring book. Um, we've all seen the Mindless books. Uh, really nice. But this one is a little different because it doesn't just have coloring pages. It's got uh, activities for you to do also. This is the back of it. This is the spine. It is Emma. It says Emma Ferrones is a French illustrator and graphic designer. This tells a little bit about her story. This is from the Experiment New York. Um, here she's talking about how you know life is stressful and what she did to start um, these books for people that you know she thought she could help and then we just get right into the coloring pages let me just do a quick flip here I like them because they're small you can put them in your purse you know just have a moment you can color um, and she has prompts on some of the pages, different things that you can do throughout the book, which is great. This is the kind of mindless stuff that I like to do when I'm sitting in front of the TV. And here she shows you how to create, using this, um, a snowflake once you've colored it. Yeah, ideas on all of the different pages here. I really like these flowers. Very pretty. Everything is black. I just don't know why my camera sometimes makes it look reddish. Here are simple embroidery templates that you can use for inspiration. Trace onto fabric and sew over the lines. I like these. I'll do these randomly. Like if I just have some leftover paint or something and I'll just color in these or a gel pen I just this is the kind of pages I like to do I have another um, I have another journal type book like this that has uh, several of them like that in it just a really pretty well done book some tea here find an interesting place a cafe or street corner a large window sit down order drink observe everything going on and write down everything right here got some cactus some random objects this one says banana skins have a very satisfying texture to draw on with a ballpoint pen mindfully draw patterns on the skin with no particular design in mind I love these flowers so different. Mindfully draw a henna pattern on this palm. You can also trace your hand on paper and create a henna pattern. The tree needs foliage. Can you mindfully draw different shaped leaves? very very interesting it's very different and right here like the last one but now you get to create your own patterns in each box write down a list of foods that you would wish to mindfully taste I like the little town This is when I started. It looked like she was going to the beach with her little beach bag. I just like the colors. I thought they were cute. Fill the painter's palette with color. Make a salad bursting with different flavors and textures. Try using 
I'm sorry, try coloring in using only cool colors. Greens, blues, and purples such as ice, blue, aqua, indigo, cobalt, duck egg, teal, turquoise, cerulean, sapphire, emerald, eggplant, amethyst, and gray on this whole thing. That's a good challenge. I'm going to have to try that one. Mice. Borders. Candles. Make room in your busy schedule for some mindful moments. And they want you to just draw any little thing for a whole week. Create a mindfulness fortune teller filled with eight different mindfulness activities. These birds are really cute. Okay, and that's it. And this is her other books. The Mindfulness Card Book and the Mindfulness Coloring Book Volume 2. I see those everywhere. Oh, and they also have a calendar. Really cute book. Um, I like it that it's small, beginner. Anybody can do this book. Your children can help you with this book. Um, just really cute to get started. Um, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you like it. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them at the bottom. And I'll post a link to where you can purchase this. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.